Hey guys, what's up? I'm Boyka, and on this video, I'm gonna be going over the last day of the event right here, and it is going to be this one, which is like challenge seven or like day seven, basically. And as you can see right here, I got 3,150 points in total, but I didn't really need that much. But as you can see right here, I have in total 22,230, and I have collected basically every single reward over here. And I'm just gonna go towards like the difficulty level over here, like what kind of boosts I choose for the boss. And then I'll be right back. So these are the ones I went with right here. The difficulty level is going to be at the uh, expert. That's why it's going to be giving me like a score multiplier of 4.5. Then the challenge time may not exceed 750 seconds. Opponent's HP increased by 25% is the one I choose as well. And these are like, a lot. I choose a lot of here. So I'm just going to go over the ones I didn't choose. So I, the ones I didn't choose are opponent's physical resistance increased by 50% is the one I didn't choose. And these three over here, as you can see, increases the stamina consumption by sprinting, uh, for off sprinting by 100%. All party members' movement speed decreased by 20%. After sprinting, all characters in your own party take 75% increased damage for 10 seconds. And finally, switching characters increases the damage taken by all, all characters in the player's party by 25%. This effect stacks up to four times. So these are the ones I didn't choose, and all of the other ones I chose. So that's gonna get me 3150 points and I'm just gonna start right here. The team is going to be Razor, Klee, Fischl and Zhongli. Zhongli I'm gonna only use on the Geo boss and the rest, like, I, I still can use him like on the, on the other bosses. But the reason I'm using Zhongli right here is because of his E, because of the pillar. If like the boss deals, uh, like starts making like a specific attack so I can use it, I'm gonna show you there. And if you don't have Zhongli you can use the Traveler, uh, but his Geo mod. How to activate the Travis's Geo mode is by basically going to uh, Liyue and finding a Statue of the Seven there. And when you go there, you can change your abilities, like the powers, from Animo to Geo. And after you have done that, come over here, set up your team, and start the challenge. So what's going to happen right here is I'm going to start the challenge, and the first boss is going to appear, which is going to be the Animo one right here. So let's see what he's going to do. Okay, here I can spawn my official bird Oz, then I can like basic attack with Razor with no problem over here. Keep attacking until he goes up. Now he's up. Let's see what kind of attack he's going to deal and depending on that I can basically activate it right here. Okay, it's the... Sp oh, okay. That was bad there. Hello. Yeah, I wouldn't want that to hit me. I'm just going to heal there with the basic food. Some at least at half there. Okay, he's gonna do this right here. I can fly up now. These are the tornadoes. You can basically dodge them, but I'm just gonna fly up. But no. Okay, I lost it there, but it's okay. Let's see. So now I'm gonna go in the middle right here. Let's see if I can. I was gonna check if I can activate all again, but it's gonna take me like a lot of time to like switch between the characters. So I'm just gonna wait for the next time to be able to like activate Oz. And here's his basic attack. Okay, I have Oz, so I'm just gonna activate him the next time he's down. Oh. Okay, I'm just gonna activate Oz right here. Switch to Razor, E, and just like that. So here you have to collect like uh, five orbs, I think. Yep, there are five orbs. Uh, four of them are gonna be like still, they're not gonna move at all, but one of them is gonna like be going around. So let's see, I have one more left, I don't know if I'm going to be able to collect it, but oh, I did, okay, nice. So now we're just going to have to wait for the boss to go down, and we can kill him after that. Okay, let's go in the middle here, one E, and then just basic attacks, nice. So here we have the Electro one after, and finally the Geo boss is going to be the final boss that's going to be activated. Just come over here and basic attack him. As you know, since I'm with like a Razor and he's Electro, I cannot like deal a lot of damage to the boss because he's also Electro, so he's immune against it. But if you want to use like a Razor's uh, ultimate, I'm gonna show you like on which attack to use to like have like the most effective, like the, the most effect on it. So you can like use it for the like longest time. Let's see when he's gonna like activate that attack. So I can like ult with Razor there. Triple attack again. Oh, this is gonna be deal damage to me, so I'm just gonna use my Klee. Okay. Okay, I could deal some damage there, not bad. Let's see. 
he went to the middle okay here we ha we can use like racer ultimate because this is like one of the attacks like that takes like the longest time and again it's gonna be like immune against like the wolf's attacks but the thing good that's like good right here is that razor is gonna be have like a faster like attack speed so that's the only reason i'm using like a racer ultimate right here not because of the wolf it's just like he like attacks faster basically So just keep chasing him like this. If you go behind that uh, those attacks, he's not gonna like be able to like turn around and like hit you like that. So just stay behind them. So here we can like start attacking the pillars. Where are they? So we have three right here. Nice. We can use her E here. One more time. Then he's down. Then we have these two right here. Come on. Hello. 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 Oh. Okay, I can destroy them. I didn't have my E. It's okay. Well, what you do after, if you can destroy him, is like just wait. And then go back there and fight him again. Until he's down again. Okay, he's down right here. Let me see where they are. They're right here. Then we can destroy these last two as one as well. And then he's down. And now, finally, the Geo boss is going to spawn. Okay, he's there. He's gonna go down here. What you wanna do right here for this one is like come over here behind this pillar. And start attacking it like as fast as you can. It's almost down here. Now it's down. And now the other pillars are gonna start shooting at you. So like what I do right here is like three attacks and then dodge, like dash away. One, two, three, dash away. One, two, three, dash away. And that's like the way I dodge them at least. And I'm gonna go to the middle right here and see where the boss is going to go. So I can like actually go there and like destroy the destroy this right here. One more attack, nice. Let me just heal my razor over here so I don't want him to die. Okay. What I want to do right here is like basically ult with, ra ult with razor here. Just to like be able to like destroy the pillar as fast as I can. So I deal like damage to the boss as much as I can right here. And now we have two pillars left right here. So I'm gonna see where he goes, like to what pillar. And then I'm gonna basically destroy the other pillar that he's not at. Let's see. So he went to that one, so I'm just gonna go over here, but this one's right here. Let me try to like dodge those first. One, two. Okay, the last one hit me and my razor is dead. Yeah, I don't know how it hit me, but it's okay. I'm just gonna heal my razor right here again. As much as I can basically. Come back here and destroy this pillar. Now he's gonna like fire those at uh, this pillar right here so he can like start attacking me but if he destroys he's not gonna be able to do that. So now I can go to this pillar right here. Let's see what he's gonna do right here. Okay, I don't like this attack right here. Just run away from it. Now I can attack with official right here because you don't wanna go like go inside that circle because it's gonna deal damage to you. Let's see the next attack. Okay, he did this right here. So what you want to do right here is like pull, it, uh, pull up your like pillar right here with like Zone Lee or like the Shoveler, whoever you're using. So I'm, like just like climb on top of it and wait for this attack to be over. And if you're like really close to the boss, you can just like glide above him and then like dash down and start attacking him immediately. I'm gonna do this right now. Maybe one more attack right here. And now he's done. Now I can dash. Just like that. I don't have my ultimate though sadly with Razor, but I still think that I can like oh. I still think I can like destroy it with no problem. One pillar left right here. And just like that we're done with like basically day seven and uh, if you like use the same settings as, as I use there, like the boost and stuff, you're gonna get 3150 points. And you're gonna be done with like day seven and basically the event if you have gotten like enough points from the older days. And as I said like before, I didn't need like that many points, but I still like want to like get more than usual to like to see like how much I can like go up to like max. And this is the one this is like how much I could do it for. Let me see the points again, like the max points I got right here. It's right here. 22,230 points. And yeah, I basically got all the rewards right here.
and good luck with the event this is like the last day so if you still haven't like uh done these days over here you still have like eight days remaining as you can see right here time remaining eight days so you still have like a, around like a one week like more than one week to like be able to like clear this challenge right here so if the video was helpful don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more videos like this and i'm gonna see you in the next one bye bye take care